YouTube. This is a description on the AliExpress tie rod ends for the FD3S RX7. I picked these up on sale on their Black Day Friday and it was $30 or $40 shipped to my house in Canada and I couldn't say no to that because I do need these as I'm putting a different engine in my FD and I had to st space down the steering rack a couple inches. So in order not to have horrendous bump steer, I need something like this. And all the other ones are about, you know, $100 for both. And that's not too bad, but I don't want to spend much money on this car. But here they are. Uh, taper's nice. Everything's good. It is adjustable. Like, you could put that spacer on the other end and lower it down a little bit if you don't need that much. But in my case, you know, I, I need as much as I can get. Um, you know, you can compare them to the OAM one. And, uh... You know, you can see the height you'll get. It's substantial, because you do have to look. It does fall down on that taper there. And uh, I've got one in my upright already. And uh, it's in there. It, it fits in. You know, I don't want to torque it in, because I don't want to have to hit it out. But there is room there for the taper to uh, to make a good positive fit on it. You know, it comes with nylocks, and it does look like there is enough thread to engage the nylock, and, and it has the adapter piece on it with the jam nut, and uh, overall, it looks like a fantastic purchase for uh, $40 shipped to my house, and if anyone else is looking for these, I'd say go for them. And uh, that's everything. And if you want to know anything more about my car, uh, feel free to, uh, to hit me a message about it.